Hit it, band. <laughs> Hey there, it's Jamie Anderson, and in this lesson I'm going to teach you how to play a blues lead in the key of G, otherwise known as a minor pentatonic scale, and I'll show you some riffs that go with it too. This is Lee Walsh, the band. She's going to be playing the rhythm part here. Um, so a lot of you are beginners to playing lead, and you're like, oh my gosh, how do I know what notes to choose? Well, I'm going to show you. A minor pentatonic scale is only five notes, and it's the same pattern all up and down the neck. So, if you did the first video, which I hope you did, and that was showing you how to do this in the key of A, it's the same pattern, but instead of starting at the fifth fret, which is where the A is, you're going to start at the third fret. But before I show you all of that, you're going to hit the red subscribe button and the notification bell because you don't want to miss any of my lessons, right? Here's a G minor pentatonic scale or a G blue scale. Start right here on this top string third fret in the 6th fret with your little finger, and you're going to keep going back to that 3rd fret, 5th fret this time, 3, 5, 3, 5, 3, 6, 3, 6. See if you can do that backwards. Nice and slow. So if you did the first lesson where I teach in the key of A, you learned three riffs. Well, guess what? Those riffs also work in the key of G. You just move them down. For instance, that Chuck Berry lick, which starts on the fifth fret if you're playing it in the key of A, if you move it down to the third fret, you're in the key of G. Same pattern. Same thing for riff number one and two. And here's number two. All right, so here are those riffs in the key of G. I'm starting with my third finger on that fifth fret. Here's the bend. Here's riff number two. And here's the Chuck Berry lick. Now if those are too fast, turn off the video and practice it on your own as slow as you need to. Now I'll show you how it plugs into the song. Lee's going to play the chords for um, Hound Dog because that's a 12 bar blues and this is a blues lead that I'm teaching you and I'll show you how that can all fit in. I'm also going to be the singer. You're making me do everything. Yeah. Singing and playing the lead. You get paid. <laughs> Is that how it works? Yeah. Okay. All right. Ready? Go, band. We ain't nothing but a hound dog. Crying all the time. You ain't nothing but You was high class. That was just a lie. They said you was high class. That was just a lie. Well, you ain't never caught a rabbit, and you ain't no friend of mine. There you go. Hound Dog in the key of G. Now I went a little fast there, but could you hear all those riffs that I was putting in there? I was also putting in parts of this scale here. 
So what you want to do, if that went too fast for you, turn this video off and play through that scale just as slow as you need to. Use the diagram that I gave you earlier. Now we're going to jam a little bit in the key of G. I'm going to play parts of that G minor pentatonic scale that I showed you, the blues scale. And Leah's going to play a 12 bar blues in the key of G. It's not any particular song, this is just a common form that you hear a lot in blues. Alright, hit it band. my other lessons. I have over 300 lessons for guitar, mandolin, and ukulele. If you want to support the work I do, buy me a coffee. It's just $3. Coffee.com and I'll put the link somewhere in this video or maybe underneath. You can also support me via Patreon and I also am a singer-songwriter. You can check out my work at jamieanderson.com. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks to Lee for being my band.